Global Action Team is a powerful bridge between the Lions and the International. Now let us invite the Chairman of the GATT, PIP Kajit Habnananda, to address the gathering. Chairman, distinguished past international presidents, international directors, past international directors, leadership at all level, at multiple district and sub district, down to the club, presidents, fellow lines. First of all, I wish to express my appreciation and thank you for the invitation for me to participate in the Isami Forum this year. Your constitution area six had been known to be one of the most active area in the world. Of course, you often rank number one in membership and services. As such, this particular time, the meeting had to be done on the virtual meeting. And that is through Zoom, Kudo and other systems that are invented shortly, which is make it possible for many lions to attend while they can be at home at leisure or in the office. However, it sounds a bit strange to hold a forum or a convention in this manner. But however, due to the COVID-19 pandemic, there is nothing that we can do to make otherwise. We are all going through this difficult experience together around the world. This pandemic has created a lot of difficulties and make the traveling rather limited or impossible. As you know, the lions gather so that at the meeting so that we could express our appreciation and feeling toward our fellow lions, and that is the fellowship. At each meeting, fellowship is abound, but meeting virtual like this I believe that we would lose out the fellowship part. But however, with us still is the members who are willing to spend some time and try to get involved in all these activities and activities that going around in our constitutional area concerning the, what I call it, public service that given by the Lions member, there are <coughs> things that Lions still continue to do, even in this difficult time. I think many, most of the Lions are still meeting. However, it could not be face to face, but still virtual meeting. Uh, the activities of the services uh, still continue with the community because the community knows who are the Lions. And we, the Lions, have dedicated our life and our time and our effort to make a community a better place to live. And we're willing to do it now and in the future, whether COVID pandemic or not. The CA6, which is Isame, had done most of the gathering and meeting in virtual channel, and very successful meeting at that during the last eight months, keeping the interest and the motivated members to attend. Now, several area forum in the world uh, actually have to cancel the, 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 the meeting because of this pandemic. But Isame, you managed to hold it this particular year. So congratulations to the leadership and especially those who have spent a lot of time and effort putting this forum together. <clears throat> and my sincere Thanks and appreciation go to all who have made 
this gathering happen. <coughs> the, let me just quickly remind you that uh, the Global Action Team, which is now a well-known activity throughout the world, which is much better than last year or the year before. Now, most of the members are aware what is the Global Action Team or a GAT or a GAT. In your constitutional area, the GAT effort is had to be uh, commended for the what the what they have done for the members uh, the, from the club level up to the district and to multiple district. So just a quick reminder that the Global Action Team is a moving energy to create action. And once the action is created, and then they'll make that impact. And who do we make the impact on? On services, on membership, or, and on leadership development from the club level up through the district and multiple district, all the way up to the international level. Now, what I usually call GAT activities as S, or I refer to it as SML. S refer to service, of course, the service that the club perform with their community in whatever endeavor they chose. That could be in hospitalized hospitals uh, improvement, could be education, could be health, could be environment, could be anything that the club feel free to select it. However, the service is so are so vast that are done have, that have been done by the Lions Club around the world. And of course, the membership, the M, the membership now is the key point. I think it's the key to the whole thing that our association will survive or not. But I, I believe we will because for the, we have survived for the past 103 years. And we rode through a few difficulties in time. But with this pandemic, I think the Lions Club have actually adapted themselves and, and managed to go through this difficult period and coming out in a flying color in many areas. <clears throat> so the membership is the key. And the membership of the of Isami area uh, is very high. By the way, your membership had been sort of a up and down during the past few years, but I believe you, got, you, you people get the hang of it now and the number is had on an increasing tremendously. The last word I got was you have added 28,000 new members and with the 600 new Lions Club. And this is an accomplishment and my congratulation on the effort that has been put into it. <coughs> with the numbers as great as, as in, in Isame, and this is would means that there are more hands to go out and help and support the less fortunate and the underprivileged. The Isame Alliance have shown us the way how to recruit new members. And they have done that for many years. Now, the only thing that I would just want to add here is if you can keep what you get, and that would be worth much more. In other words, uh, retention. Oh, people don't like that word, but I think there is no other way of saying it. Or the what you could call it, uh, membership services and things like that. However, it is important that we would be able to keep what we have. When you're recruiting new members, I think the key, the key here, is to quickly get the new members involved on all activities at the club level and also try to get their commitment being through either S or M or L. Get them involved in the service that the club perform to the community or other, other service that they choose. Or get them involved in going out and look for new blood and uh, re uh, inviting more new members to join the club. Now, some of them like to interact with the uh, with the communities, then this is probably suit them by talking to other people, tell them and show them what the Lions Club are doing and who benefit this getting it. And what do you get out of becoming a Lions Club member? And of course, 
the L part, the leadership development. As many mem members are added to our association and to the club, it is important that we should look out for them. There are many, many talents are hidden in our membership. Uh, we should look for the potential leaders that would be our future leaders. And once you spot them or recognize them, nurture them and bring them around because they are the, our future. And once you, you got them, I think you should put them through the tra proper training. And Lions Club International has so many, many training programs, hundreds of them, in fact, that one of them would certainly fit whoever the members chose to be. And I believe that the SMOL are the key platform that the Lions Club can in, in a stay in existence. And that means that 1.4 million Lions around the world are performing the same duty, similar things, performing the same duties and acting out the same action. And at the same time, this created the, the action and impact. And that's, of course, is part of the global action team. So in other words, GAT is, a, is instilled in each and every one of the, the members of the club, where the club president is the GAT chairperson. So with that, I think it's up to the club president at the club level to set aside what program and what activities the club will perform in order to benefit the communities locally and benefit their own members and give them the opportunity to be trained to be a better informed person, a better leaders. We have many managers in our business, but we have very few leaders because their roles are quite different, managers or leaders. But I think most of our members are actually our leaders in their own right, one way or the other. So the leadership is as much as important as the membership or the service. Again, light is all about energy. Try to, to feel the energy that in you and around you. Because once you find that, you can distinguish the positive energy and the negative energy. The positive energy, of course, will bring you more rewards and bring you more fellowship and more friendship. And whereas the negative uh, energy, well, of course, that would discourage members. That means the club become weak and no activities or very little activities. So eventually the club will call the sleeping club and eventually you have to be closed down. So we are all, don't forget, we are all volunteers. The only thing that keep us here is that we can do something that can make a difference to the less fortunate. Once the people lose interest that they were looking for, that they enter the club, then they will leave eventually. There's nothing there for them to hold their interest anymore. So the secret is keeping the member interest up through the activities of service, membership, and leadership development. Get that commitment early, as I said before, and when they first enter the club, and give them the responsibility. Because without responsibility, the new members feel that, well, they don't really need me, and I don't really have any authority or any responsible uh, position to perform any activities. So this is the best retention yet. It's a secret of retention by keeping the members involved, active, and recognized. And with that recognition, I think the members uh, will certainly appreciate what we are doing here. The next thing is that I believe that uh, the utilize the uh, what I call Lion's Leader Cent Lion Learning Center. The Lion Learning Center has been set up by the Lions Club International for some time and is the wealth of information, the system, the training courses that they have available for all members to be trained. In fact, from the club officers, new members, 
anything up to the district and multiple district level. You can be trained and you can have, utilize the Lions Leaders, Leadership Center, uh, Training Center here. And I encourage each and every one of you have a look at it. And then it's so simple to register and get the information by once you're in it, you will receive the latest information from the Lunch Club International. You got new programs, new initiatives, the new policies or any policies that are changing currently, then you will be up to date. And many programs are suit for everyone. So it is important that uh, you keep up and learn about the, what, the new development coming from Lions Club International. Now, recognizing the recognizing the, the GAT of the area to help to clear the outstanding due in your constitution area. I think this is one that to be to be commended because there are a lot of outstanding due uh, in the past year or two, but now the majority of it had been cleared up and it works so that we could keep the membership and the club active and ongoing. And uh, of course, this GAT team has helped to improve the member experience in retaining the membership as well. They encourage Lion to take advantage of the uh, Lion Learning Center by introducing new courses, motivate the G GLT uh, coordinators to report all the local trainings. And this is a must. And talking about reporting system, I think we are seeing a lot of improvement in the reporting back from, up from the line from the club to the district, to the multiple district, and all the way up to the Lions International. By reporting correctly, then we would have, as an organization, a statistic that we could be rely on, and we could talk about it or could improve it or could adjust it. And this is important because I believe each Lions Club, when they perform their, their function, the service, it is, uh, it, the, the function would be a successful function. And therefore, there would be a successful story attached to each one of them. So each, each activity is a successful story in itself. So by selecting the best that happened from each club throughout the year, I think you will end up with many, many, many good story that would encourage other clubs, other members to follow suit. And I think you, in fact, if you do it right and your success story had been selected by the Lions Club International, I think the club or the district will receive the reward as well in monetary fund. So great, great works are awaiting for each and one, every Lions Club to do, to perform. And of course, my, com my commend for, for go to the club that I'm hold their virtual meeting. I know it's difficult even for the club members to attend face-to-face -face meeting, but holding the virtual meeting is another way of keeping the association going and keeping the service alive and interest of the member abound. So it is the success story on a toll on webinar in your constitution area is an outstanding one. I believe you have at least 50 very successful uh, success story to be told on the your webinar in the coming months before the year end. And this is the good news. And that shows me, uh, tells me that the lines are out there working very hard. Yeah, after all, there are some difficulties that they are facing, but yet they are coming through with the flying color. The, <clears throat> the great work in uh, Lions Club should be told to the public and it should never be kept a secret anymore. So we will try not to keep our Lions Club a secret association <laughs> like we all used to know about it. Now, I would like to say that the problem that we do facing now is that many, many of our clubs do not have a proper plan. 
including the annual planning. When the new president and the with the new the club officers started the logistic year, they should plan their year activities out very clearly. So let the members know exactly what the clubs wish them to do. In that way, then you keep the members active and alive and you will get the report from them. And I believe also that comparing from Lions Club to the other Lions Club within the same zone is very important. So here you have the zone chairperson who will act as the coordinator, listening to the success story, listening to the issue, listening to the problems and how to solve this problem among the four or five Lions Club within that zone. I think it would make helping the activities become mean more meaningful. So again, the zone meeting is out there and make use of it. District governors can receive the report from the zone chair and then report it on up the line so that the target of the district, the goal of the, your district would be fulfilled. And therefore, this last year, this year and the future year, that would be called the district goal and not district governor goal anymore. So everybody have a part in it. They play this important role. So I would say that <clears throat> it is uh, important that we are all keeping abreast, listening to the speakers. And of course, the in the GAT uh, REM, there are past district governors, past officers at the district and multiple district or international are a member of our global action team ambassador. And this ambassador do travel around within their own constitu constitutional area. And I would request them in person that please talk about this uh, GAT and the work of the GAT. Make sure that because of the GAT activities, the lines are now finally are united to do the same thing all around the world in all throughout the eight constitutional area. Now, I am not sure when would the pandemic would cease. I believe we probably they are waiting for the, the, the vaccine to be discovered and truly try and test it. And until then, I think we have to make do with what we can with the facilities that we have at our own hands. However, it doesn't mean that the Lions Club activity will have to come to a standstill. In fact, it gives us and shows us a new approach, a new way of finding out how we can do new things a different way. And the old thing, a different direction also. And this is important. I myself, I have not been traveling for the past eight and a half months. And I find it a little strange because uh, I usually travel all the time and uh, meeting lions and seeing their activities, seeing their projects. And, and of course, this is sort of a, a little different feeling. But eventually, we adjust to all these changes. And we are now in the world of changing. And therefore, change is coming. And doesn't matter what we do now or the future, we have to adjust, adapt it, and try to recover and the best we can. And I think the Lions Club International had come a long way in doing this. And we are working with the new marketing approach, with technologies approach, and utilizing everything that's available out there. Now, don't forget, we are all volunteers. And it, was, and it is important that the volunteers need to pay attention and we need to keep their interest up. Volunteers don't get paid. Nobody pay me a dime and no one pays you a dollar either. And you have to come on weekends and there's no double pay. So therefore, keep the interest at hand and share the interest and share the success story and share the effort and share all the things that you always do when you meet face to face. So with that, I think we all miss our leaders at times. I know we have not met our presidents, 
We have not really met our vice president, and some of you are already meeting of your international director of the area. You're lucky. So in some area, they don't have international directors. So they haven't got any leaders. They haven't got anybody that they could lean on. But I think Isami has a vast pool of the leadership. You have several past president and all the past officer that are the wealth of information. And they are terrific, fantastic leaders. I know them and I met them all. And I believe that all of them are still active. The only part that uh, I find that they are not fully utilized are the PDGs of the past district governors. You have at least 2,000 past district governors in your constitution area. And 2,000 past leaders uh, is a tremendous amount of force, a very forceful team indeed. So if you can make sure that your past district governor continue to stay active in their own club, in their own area or their own district, I think that would be a tremendous uh, a change. And there would be uh, an added value to the Alliance members, especially the newcomers. I know we're trying to pluck the hole and to stop the leaking of the membership in everywhere, in every country, but it seemed to happen. But if we can slow down this leak, I think the effort of getting new members would be less. But still, we are keeping our numbers up, and I think that's important. So, with that, I would like to say that <coughs> your forum is coming to uh, standing that with so many thousand participate virtually, and this is this is quite wonderful. And I hope that the other area are copying the Isame, the way you handle the forum, and with so many attendees. And with that, I would like to say that stay with us. You join the Lions because you enjoy the fellowship. You join the Lions because it gives you the opportunity to serve. You become a Lion because you like to have friends. And I think the Lions can make you whoever you want to be. So stay with us. Do the best you can. Stay out of trouble. And let's hope that we could meet face to face in the near future. Good luck and the best for your forum. Thank you. Presiding Officer ID Dr. Nawal Malu, International President Chang Yul Choi, Executives, Dignitaries, Directors, Fellow Lions. Today I am here in our Isame Forum to talk about a specialty club. As the topic says, this is time for a specialty club. Specialty clubs are the unique expression of the diversity of Lions Clubs International, uniting men and women around the causes, cultures, interests and professions. Lions Club and service are not only the connecting thread, but we might have other connecting thread. You and me may be coming from the same profession or maybe may have same hobby and specialty clubs take a deep diving in this diversity. There are many types of specialty clubs. I would say professional or educational clubs. They are from the same profession like doctors, engineers, chartered accountant, maybe any profession, maybe stamp collectors or they may have same hobby and sports like going to Zumba, going to morning walks, yoga or playing soccer, maybe tango dancing. 
may be wine tasting so they can be called sports or hobby clubs cause eccentric the clubs which are dedicated to single service like diabetes environment education friends you might be knowing this but i am repeating just to refresh or if some of the fellow men doesn't know it life stages are those clubs which are of the members of different life stages like retiree clubs there are retired people who have lot of energy left in them but they have no engagement cultural club are those clubs which are united by their culture or ethnicity in our area in nishame there is lot of diversity people have migrated from one place to another if we call of great country of india there are many states south indians tamil malayalam all have migrated to another part and the same applies to sikhs same applies to bengalis so they 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 can form their own clubs and maybe our area people migrated all over the world can form their specialty club friends nothing succeeds like success specialty club has completed its 3 year program last year and it has become the permanent program of lions club international it was pilot program for 3 year and now it is a permanent program of lions club international and it has success story from all over the world 100000 members are about to reach maybe in one month we will have 100000 specialty members this year only 51% of the clubs organized are specialty that means majority of the club organized this year are specialty you can see on the screen all the areas have three figures i mean 400 300 clubs isame has 1929 clubs this includes those clubs also which were organized before the program came the membership engine of the world is isame and isame contributed the major part of a specialty club over 51% i have told are specialty this year friends these are the statistics where 648 clubs are organized this year in isame out of that 377 clubs are specialty that means the program is being used for the growth in new market new areas i have given you the look of the called specialty club organized by coordinators isami currently have 52 coordinators and you can see that specialty coordinators have organized organized 699 clubs this is the immense success of the coordinators who have been working for specialty clubs it also provides flexible framework for services by promoting collaborator through the shared regional or global service passions i mentioned you we are a global organization but we rarely connect with the clubs in other part of globe now with the same passion we have a bridge we have an opportunity to walk together share our experience and branch club which is less utilized in our organization but now we are working very successfully with the branch clubs of different passion and by this specialty club coming forward 
the needs of the meeting have changed the operation of meeting are changing and now there are many meeting on web many meetings on other systems so specialty club provides flexible framework in ng a club was formed of the people who live on moving houses initially it was thought what should be the address which district they will be registered but now they have become a specialty club and they keep on moving with their uh, houses or vehicle friends there are different categories i have mentioned when we have cause specific then we have four of our priority areas if our club is not under those four we can specify on others cultural life stages partnership sports hobby and other i would request you to report it properly we are developing uh, the facility to identify and co-work that means different pass uh, specialty club with different passion can work together so i would request i receive many calls many emails that they have not specified their specialty club i would request it is too easy while you report a club there is a question is it a specialty club if it is a specialty club do say yes and then it will ask what type of a specialty club club it is you can mention click on the type of a specialty club it is very important if someone of you have missed to report and it is a specialty club you yourself can amend its specialty from traditional to specialty club or if some specialty club wants to exist as traditional club in future they can change their status from traditional specialty club to traditional club one time a year that means in a year one time you have opportunity to change your status specialty club coordinators i would request the leaders the lions please move forward create an example by creating one specialty club specialty club are like modern vehicles model cars which have lot of good tapestry or which has powerful engines the skeleton of the vehicle are the same but they are very comfortable they are easy to drive so a skeleton of a specialty club is also same but they are easy to do you need to identify one person with his profession his hobby or anything he himself can lead to a club and that is too easy i was talking to a club consultant in us and he mentioned easy to form easy to survive i would request to take a test drive test drive of a specialty club if you try to form one i promise it will be formed so fast that you will continue to do it those who wish to do it in bigger numbers i request them to come forward to make specialty clubs and be a coordinator of a specialty club anyone and everyone can become a coordinator of a specialty club other than serving governor for becoming a specialty club you need a signature endorsement of your district governor and your gmt coordinator this is a two page form available on website please download and be a specialty coordinator i would encourage district governors and gmt district coordinator to identify the line who have 
the fire in belly to form new clubs and given an opportunity to be coordinator you can have more than one coordinator in your district also application has to be approved before organizing the club sometime i receive call that i have done three clubs and how can i assess or re get reimbursed my expenses it will not be possible so apply it i promise we respond very fast and maybe within 24 hours or subsequently you would get the response coordinator can submit uh, have to submit a development plan how they are thinking and what they plan to do and they can submit more than one plan also for isami minimum 3 club and 100 charter member are required and you will be allowed an expense of maximum 2000 dollar friends i would encourage you to be a specialty club coordinator and utilize this opportunity when when you have lot of areas where you can move to organize specialty clubs when this program is started we used to call it tap the untapped market and you have that opportunity isame is the leader not only in membership growth but also in the form of formation of a specialty club apply to become coordinator this is my request friends we need to promote promote where on the network on the web pages our multiple and distinct websites we can write a stories many of you have formed a specialty club so you can write a stories its success implementation of service on social media like facebook groups like in linkedin or lci news feed so these these are the platforms which can be utilized for promotion of the specialty club and our program friends i am sure that most of you might have listened about news feed we can go to www.linesclubs.org and on the member portal there is news feed and you can write about your services your success your club's success everything can be uh, kept on those news feed so please utilize uh, the support unit is just like you go to social media we write on facebook we write on uh, twitter and lot of handles you can also write on news feed which is lions club lions clubs own promotional platform so i have kept this slide where we are showing how to create a post sorted by filtered by when you want to see something you can sort you can filter as you do in lot of social media i have been talking to many lines and then i have come to know that lot of us are not using news feed i would say please use for promotion of your activity and let the world know and then they you can connect with each other if not physically or some experience share so uh, there is also a uh, insight lci website also have insights is a data information application with access to membership and service activity and club information again go to www.linesclubs.org and member portal you can also see a specialty club there where in in insights you can see a specialty club you can filter it constitutional area wise if you want to connect with some specialty club in a particular constitutional area 
or multiple district or district. I would again repeat, the specialty clubs are formed not around the community but around the passions. So once you are filtering them, the list will help you to connect your club with that particular club of same passion. So friends, we are global organization. That means we need to connect with each other globally. And in that aspect, we need to do few more activities. This insights, the news feed will help you. LCI is working on another platforms also where the connection of global members becomes more evident. So I would encourage you to go on website, take a deep diving on these particular uh, features. Friends, we can also pull out a specialty club reports and again on member portal we can go and a specialty club report is available there you yourself can pull out a specialty club report of whatsoever area or world you want to see there are a lot of videos available on website of a specialty clubs it is available in different language. You need to select the language. I mean, when I say different language, the templates will come in different language so that you can read. So I would say, download those videos according to your need. If you are going to a diabetes group, you can have specific videos. Cultural clubs, you will have a specific videos. There are presentations also available for your use. Learn how to charter a specialty club. We are organizing and there are web series available for a specialty club, how to organize a specialty club. Again, I will request you to go to SCP series and you will see the web series where you can try to learn how to organize a specialty club. SCP toolkits are available, also available. There are a lot of material which has been developed in last four years. Sometimes we use less of it. Today, in this presentation, I am requesting you to take a deep diving. If you have any struggle or any problem at any juncture of time, do write us. We will be ready to help you hand in hand and LCI also, uh, the Specialty Club Program Specialist, Gene World will also be ready to support you in all your endeavors. Isame, as I mentioned, is the success story of a Specialty Club. I would request each governor that please continue your endeavors, your formation of a Specialty Club, those districts, those multiples which has formed less clubs, I need, I request them to work more towards a specialty club. If you see the bigger growth which came in Isame are mostly of those multiples and districts which has organized higher number of a specialty club. It also applies globally. A specialty club we have tried in Haiti. Haiti after a big earthquake lost lineism. But now 12 specialty clubs have been organized in Haiti. Soon we are working towards formation of a full fledged specialty club district there. A question will come to your mind why specialty club? district. I would say it was tougher to organize one club, two club, three club, but 12 specialty club was easier. Doctors club, engineers club, Zoom club, army club, like that many projects 
were launched at a time. We are trying to move towards provisional districts in many parts of the world, which need to grow very fast and need to celebrate their growth. Sometimes when 1-1 one -one clubs are being increased, they are not able to celebrate. So, we are trying to work on that. Why I am sharing this? Because you have this opportunity. If you target one area where you think that we need to grow more, please target with a specialty club. You can launch lot of clubs at a time. Each of our towns in all the countries have a lot of ethnic peoples. There is no town now with one ethnicity only. But there is a majority ethnicity and the rest of other people are not coming to Lions Club or coming in less number. Please tap on them so that we can have a club represented by all. Diversity is the most important part of this organization. And when I say diversity, that means accepting anyone in its original form without any change. So with these words, I thank the organizer for giving me opportunity in this inaugural session and also thank each one of you for listening me. Wish you all the success. Wish Ishame all the success. Thank you. Thank you PID Sanjay Kethan for the wonderful session.